How can a country go bankrupt? A country has both expenses and income. Its income comes from the taxes we pay, and its expenses are the costs needed to keep the country running, infrastructure and investment, and social welfare. The difference between a country's income and expenses is called the primary balance, which can be a surplus or deficit. A country must also deduct from its primary balance the repayments on its debt. If a country is running a deficit, it must borrow money to continue functioning normally. But at what point does a country's debt become unsustainable? First, economists look at the ratio of GDP, which is an indicator of the country's wealth directly linked to the growth, to the debt. If a country has little or no GDP growth, its ratio of debt to GDP will likely rise, making the debt increasingly difficult to service. Economists also look at the interest rates on a country's debt. A country borrows money by issuing sovereign bonds, i.e. parts of its debt, which are then bought and sold in the financial markets. The interest rate, or yield, on a sovereign bond is based on the number of investors confident in the country's ability to meet its bond payments. This confidence is largely based on the country's credit rating, established by rating agencies, the well-known AAA. These ratings are based on several criteria such as a country's economic climate, political stability, and monetary and budgetary policies. If a country's rating is downgraded, investors are likely to lose confidence in the country's ability to pay back. They will no longer be willing to buy its bonds. This pushes bond yields up further, increasing the country's interest payments and making it even more difficult for the country to meet its payments. The only way to slow its debt is for a country to run a budget surplus. But if it has too much outstanding debt or if its bond yields are too high, the country may find itself unable to repay existing bonds without issuing new ones. These new bonds simply add to the country's debt burden in future years, make it more difficult for the country to balance its budget and possibly to downgrade the country's credit rating, all of which push bond yields up further and necessitate more borrowing to pay them. In this bleak scenario, the country's debt eventually spirals out of control, forcing the country to declare bankruptcy.